looking in a cage. I'm hungry for I love that intro. Oh, it's so cute. Yeah. Hey guys, how's it going? Yeah, Pretty dude, good. It's a good intro, Christian. I like that. Oh, welcome. Have a seat. Sit down. Pull up a chair. We've been waiting for you. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Whoa. Yikes. Um, Chill out. Should I leave you guys alone? <laughs> so how's everybody been? Oh, good. I've been good. I hope so. Good. <laughs> what was that? That was a little face whistle. See? It's, it's a whistle, whistle, but it looks like uh, a face. It's made out of someone's face. Oh, it uh-huh. is a face Disgusting. whistle. Someone's been skinned. Ugh. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Good deal. All right. I don't even know what to say. I like, went to really? Canada. Oh, she went to Canada. Canada. That was Canadia. What's it was going good. on? It was, it was warmer than it was when I got back here to Los Angeles. In Canada? It was Canada? warmer in Canada. Wow. The whole time I was there than when I got back to Los Angeles. Wait, so it was in like the 80s up there? Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's still wow. in the 80s. There. Was... Everyone's still wearing like, you know, but high top sh- sneakers. And... Wait, having been... We're doing that here, BTW. <laughs> when was the last time you went to Canadia? Um, Like a couple days ago. No, no I mean no, before, before that. Before. Gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> um, two years so Please is it perceptible that. difference? Like, is it is there any perceptible difference no, or no? I don't know. It's it's about the same. I mean, when you came to America, did you think, oh, it's I'm just like Canada, America. or is it totally different countries to you? Um, well, see, see, I judge things by food. Uh huh. This is mm-hmm. how I how, how I live. I I go to visit a country because I want to eat their food. Oh um, yeah. You know, so so yeah, it was a completely different country because there were a lot more tacos and a lot less ketchup <laughs> chips. You know, this is the way my uh, mind works. Ketchup chips. Ketchup yeah, what are chips ketchup are aw- chips? Oh, he says, ew, ketchup chips, like he doesn't dip french fries in ketchup. Oh, wait, you guys still get different. all the, like, it's British It's not different. Foods. It's, it's potatoes in ketchup. It's really oh. not different. Wait, you guys get this, the all the British foods that we don't get here for some yeah, reason. I, I wonder why. A, probably because you guys have Look no, up. no, um, you know, no no willingness to experience new things I, I do no, such no. as ew ketchup chips ketchup. yeah I didn't and, say ew uh, did yeah, you I notice know. I didn't say so ew no I know you're, you're ew, a much ew, better ew, person ew. than Christian I'm much more sophisticated than Christian yes you're, you're much more advanced <laughs> um, worldly yeah I don't know I think that maybe wait wait just, I have a question are they still oh. a commonwealth or they just recently weren't a commonwealth of of England anymore right uh, I think they're part of the commonwealth but they're not ruled directly by England if that means anything yeah, no, that means so, something. You know, and I, I have one means. more question. I have one more Canadian question because a lot mm-hmm. of people don't realize. Pamela Anderson was famous before she was Pamela Anderson to you guys up there, huh? Because she was the Millennium Baby or she was the something baby in Canada. It's possible, really? but um, I'm not sure you 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 know my age because <laughs> I I think I missed that whole part. No, 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 no. I think they gave her. No, I think you're right. I think the entire country chipped in and gave her a free breast implants at six. <laughs> no, <laughs> she was born like July first. Um, God, what was she was born July first, like um, 1967 or something like that. What year did Baywatch come out? 92, 91. Okay, 92, I was 13. I'm just trying to say, if she was famous before I was 13, oh, she was the centennial I had no baby. freaking clue. Oh, okay. She was the point. centennial baby. Oh, like, I see what you're saying. So we were 13. I'm but she was like the Pamela Canadian Anderson centennial baby. She was the yeah. first baby born on the Canadian centennial. So she was famous for being like 100 life. years old. Like, that's what it is. Centennial, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Congrats on birthing. Yeah. Hey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Congrats so she was math. famous. She got a crown and everything. <laughs> She's a so charm. She's a like baby a charm. Um, I yeah, thought all weird. babies get crowns. I think it's one. it's all those like when something happens when they're young, they get fucked up when they're older, don't they? Like, do you notice well, that? Like the Gerber good, baby. Though. I think the Gerber baby was like, I, I, I. I Anyway, you, you hear stories. I'm not going to get into it. Wait, but the, what have you heard the about? Okay. Is he on like TMZ or something like that? No, I think there was something about male prostitution. <gasps> but Hot. Um, but the, the 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 Wendy's chick, she was a waitress at a strip joint. Oh, are right. you serious? Yeah, Wait, I isn't mean, her like, father the Wendy's thing and stuff? He's the dead. Wendy's yeah. Thing. Oh, the Wendy's the, heir. The guy? I don't know. Yeah. I just mean the, the little girl that they That's drew so with the weird. red hair and the pigtails. Well, would you say that Pamela Anderson is Canadia's greatest success story? No. Who what about be? Mike Myers, man? Mike uh, Mike Myers is Canadian. Mm-hmm. He's Canadian, Canadian. He's Canadian. I don't know. I like I think, Pamela is, Anderson is better than Mike Myers. Is Canadian or something? No. no. Jim Carrey. Jim Carrey's Jim Carrey. Canadian? There you go. Mm-hmm. I'd like to shoot. Oh shoot! I forgot my list of who to shoot in outer space. Damn it! Oh, We're gonna God, have to do don't, that next. Don't worry. I, I I can pull up the internet. We can just browse Wikipedia. <laughs> totally find anyone. Well, Jim Carrey and Robin Williams for sure. I want shot into outer space. Mm-hmm. Like I would just. 
Like that's a hard choice for me because those guys Short. molded my molded my your me your sense up. of comedy. Martin, <laughs> Martin Short is Canadian. You can't tell. We wouldn't have Christian Martin if Short it wasn't awesome. for Robin Williams Martin and Jim Carrey. Who is Martin Short? Oh, I hate awesome. him too. Shoot him into outer space. But I love Steve Martin, I love Martin SCTV, Short, though. Chevy Chase. Was John Candy? John I love SCTV, oh, which was from Toronto. The, the guy, the guy, um, Eugene, something. Eugene Levy. Yeah, he's funny. He's I like Canadian. him, and so is Jim Can- John Candy. Is John Candy Canadian? I, I yeah, he was Canadian, Canadian as well. Yeah, and, Bacon, yeah. and Eugene Levy yeah. was Canadian. Yeah. Oh, he, yeah. I love John Candy. I loved him. Uncle Buck is one of my favorite movies ever. It's great. I love it. You love it? I didn't like John. I love Candy. Uncle you didn't Buck. like John Candy? Mm-hmm. Did not care for him. Wow. Eugene Levy, I like. Eugene Levy, I like. Martin Short. See, I used to watch SCTV. Love so SCTV. So I, I got all those guys, and it was one of those shows where I wasn't really that into it, but my brother wanted to watch it. Yeah, yeah, Kind of yeah. like Star Trek, where I just sort of sat there, and I was like... <laughs> Another Canadian. I wish I had, like, a butterfly net or something that would keep me busy outside or something. <laughs> I'm disgusted. <laughs> you weren't interested in Star Trek when you were a kid? No. Well, girls aren't usually. It's boys, because me and my brother were way into Star Trek. Have you ever been to a Star Trek convention? There are so many no, chicks I'd there. Like Really? Notice I left out hot, but there's so many chicks. There. <laughs> really? Let's go. I think we should all go. To, I would like to go to Except Star Trek Except for the convention. girls who are paid. True. The, the, the which I feel, I, I feel horribly, I mean, I've been to a lot of like gaming conventions and stuff like that, and I feel horribly like slighted, like my intelligence is, is attacked when they, they have nothing but hot chicks at booths to attract nerds. That's what they do. It's like the whole marketing But it works, thing. I'm sure. Yeah, of course it does. It's like when you go to strip joints yeah. and those guys think that the girls are into them. That cracks me up. Yeah. yeah. No. It's totally well, maybe the up. only thing that lures them out of the house is the promise <laughs> of games and boobs. Well, that's the, only, that's the only time mm. girls will be nice to them that are that hot. Yeah. That's true. I guess. Which I is guess. sad. But I mean, it's not bitchy, sad. I mean, yeah. it's like, you know, the whole world, like if we all could be really good looking, we would be and we would shun nerds ourselves. So I don't know it's like the domino effect. I feel a, I feel a certain bad. distancing. You. Yeah. What are you talking about? Oh, come on. You, if you have look you like seen... Brad Pitt, you'd be so stuck up, no, Christian. But have you seen Beauty Wow, you're saying Beach? I'm ugly. That's the thing. You just said I'm <gasps> ugly. I didn't know you looked like, like, look like Brad Pitt. You look like Robert Mitchum. Yeah, I do. I'm better looking than Brad Pitt. Have you Pitt. seen oh. Beauty and the Geek? Oh, that's uh, awesome. No, I hate show. Ashton Kutcher. I want to shoot him in outer space. But, but you should watch the show mm. anyway because it I actually heard that w- is a good idea. You know what I like about it? Uh-huh. Is even though my TV says, my, my TiVo says reality romance, it's really not a romance. And uh-huh. that's what I like about it, that it's more about, it's about the, the, the these geeky guys and these pretty ditzy girls mm-hmm. all each mm. showing each other <laughs> something about the other side uh-huh. to make them more a well-rounded person and i think it's a really cool concept and um if you watch it the girls yeah they might start off like a little bit snobby some of the geeks start off really snobby too yeah. like oh but, she's so stupid like yeah. but, but they all in the end they end up you know Do seeing how the up? other half has lives. Ever been a hook up? no but oh. I, I don't think <laughs> no. so see no, has, the first one there has been really uh, mm-hmm. maybe they didn't do good casting with the first one in terms of beauty and geeky <laughs> yeah i don't know but no, they um, had some mm, crazy I didn't see it. No- you didn't i didn't see the first you see you saw, saw the second, second one, one. Uh-huh. yeah okay well there's yeah they've they did excellent casting so the second one they they, they changed up some stuff but oh god i love it because i hate Ashton Kutcher. I just want to shoot him. But he's not on the show. Too. He is not on the show. He I'm just produced it, but oh, he doesn't yeah. even talk. Yeah. He's, he's never seen it. You never but, see him. But I, 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 I watch it with my friends, and they're like, "You should be on the show. You should be." You know, they keep t- they always tell me you should be on the show. Like, but you're not nerdy like that, are yeah, you? Well, they, 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 These they guys are like someone actually put it to MIT, me in, in yeah. this. They're like, "This is what happens after they do the makeover. You're exactly what would happen when they do the makeover, like after the show." See, that's what you should do. You should go into the casting with glasses because that's the Hollywood makeover, anyways. Like, yeah, I take, take off glasses, the glasses. And I'm like, "Oh, you're beautiful!" Oh my God, she's a starlet. Do it, yeah. do it, and you can wear your bippy tops. Mm-hmm. That's yeah, that's gonna be. <laughs> oh. No, you gotta. I, I would have so much competition being like dysfunctional really? and bizarre in front of these yeah, people. Yeah. They are messes. They yeah, are yeah. such. messes. Messes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's all so about. Sad. I think it's about learning stuff too. Like I think it's good. The people that they pick, they do need to see, you know, something more than just yeah. how they do things. Yeah, it's true. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, you should watch it. Check it out. Yeah, I'll Beauty and the out. Geek on Fox <laughs> Wednesday nights at eight. Is it really? Uh, I have no I'll idea. But, I was uh, but it's still that's, on. That's pretty sad. I've been getting. Oh. Shh. E equals M C squared. H2O is water. A meteor will destroy the Earth. And Pluto is not a planet. These things we learn in Christian's fourth grade science report. All right. Wow, I wonder what's coming up next. That's our cue. So uh, I have a movie review. Um, what? I'm just <laughs> 
gotcha. Uh, I actually gotcha. have. Gotcha. Gotcha. Here's Christian <laughs> with <laughs> the movie report. Here's yeah. Christian with geek report. Okay, go, Christian. Well, I actually um, I have a an IQ test that I took like myself you, like that you. I would like you guys to take. Oh, I'm gonna run through because it's about it's about forty questions, so I'm gonna have you guys do it equally. Forty. I would just like to to put it on the record right now. Number one, I I'm not American, so if I can't name any of your presidents, that's why. And number two, I didn't pass high school. I didn't graduate from high school, so. What year did you drop out? I'm just throwing that out there. Wow. (laughs) What year did you drop out? I'm ready to succumb. All right, good. Well, it's this is science based, so you're screwed either way. Honestly, ready, go. All right, let's do it. So it's multiple choice, so I'm going to read it down quick. All right. you all ready? Paper, pencil, everything? Yeah. Okay. God, I've I got the only it. internet access here, so I know you guys can't cheat. All right. The yeah. tendency of a moving object to stay in motion is called A, friction, B, inertia, C, gravity, D, force. B. Hey, don't say it out loud. Oh. Right Oh, down. we're gonna write it down. Okay, good. Well, no, I, I figured because I can get a, a grade on it. Well, How about are, are we pitting you guys against down. each other? Because I already know it's gonna be a dead tie between you two. You, you guys think gonna so? be like, no, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> but um, I said B too. Here, number them so you don't get oh. mixed up. Okay, right, so, so you say two. you both say B. Okay, two. The energy an object gets from its motion is a chemical energy, B potential energy, C mechanical energy, D electrical energy. Wait, repeat that. Yeah, I, yeah, I wasn't listening. What's it again? All right. The energy an object gets from its motion is chemical energy, potential energy, mechanical en- energy, or electrical energy. What that, was B again? <laughs> that's what I picked. Why potential you, energy. Why did David write down? <laughs> <laughs> wait, you should actually correct it as we go. Wait, so wait. No, what's yeah, the correct let's, number let's, for let's one? Let's do it like that. Okay. Wait, wait. The, <laughs> Here, you better guess what it the, is. I, I'm trying to think. The energy. Read the question again. <laughs> this is awesome radio. The energy an object gets from its motion is A, chemical energy, B, potential energy, C, mechanical energy, D, electrical energy. <sighs> this, is, this is the fourth grade science report, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, was I think it's just mana. They missed mana. There kinetic? should be mana, that energy, and rage. <laughs> Those mana. Be, yeah. What's mana like? God. No, mana is magical. Energy. Here, you gotta get. You gotta. Imp- you gotta, gotta impose emotion? a time limit on her. Dun 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 dun. dun, dun I didn't get the question. Dun, 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 I, I'm not getting my head dun, around this. Dun 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 dun. Da, 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 da. That's not helping. Uh, <laughs> can you just read the question? Would you prefer 99 bottles of beer on the wall? All right, yeah. All right. Okay. The energy an object gets from its motion. Okay. Is Chemical energy, potential energy, mechanical energy, or electrical energy. I should actually do. <laughs> <I> should, <laughs> she she dropped the pen. <laughs> it's like, nope, that's it. Hey, wait, I, let's I give up. Let's go back to number one. All right, let's go to number one. What's the correct uh, answer? Number one, the tendency of a moving object to stay in motion is called a friction, b inertia, c gravity, d force. The answer is b inertia. Yay, I got it right. Yay, you both got it right. You guys are 100 percent one for one. I like that. I got that one right. Just to let you know. All right, sorry. All right, <laughs> I'm, I'm not convinced about number okay, two. Okay, the energy an object gets from its motion is a b c d. Which did you choose, David? I choose b. B two. potential. What yeah, did you I did B. All right. I thought you wrote D, honestly. No. All right. It was. I probably would have been right if I wrote D. No, now. it's um, mechanical energy, C. Ah, I knew. It's, it's when it's, it's here, just, right. just existing, you. it has the potential energy, right? Not when it's moving. I got it wrong, too. I don't know. Oh, it doesn't okay. You know what? That's stupid. I'm what stupid. was it? It was Go mechanical ahead. energy? I, I, mechanical. I probably would have said electrical energy I'm anyway. Like so. Backpedaling <laughs> yeah, no. right, keep going. You know what? People <laughs> without mics aren't allowed to talk, jackal. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay, good. what's number three? All right, three. Rubber, glass, and plastic. Rubber. Are- <laughs> no. All right. Yeah, she doesn't want any more kids. Okay. No. All right. Uh, rubber, glass, and plastic are good. A, electromagnets. B, generators. C, insulators. D, conductors. Pencils down. I got that Wait, one right. Rubber, glass, and plastic? Mm-hmm. Electromagnets, generators, insulators, conductors. Okay. I'm done. Okay, good. I wrote my letter. The correct answer is insulators. C, insulators. Yay! I got it right. C, they even put it in Spanish for you, so you know what's going on. All right, keep going. I like how he's covering it, because I didn't even look at your paper (laughs) when I wrote my letter C. I don't know if you noticed, though. I did half a C, and then I'm like, "Eh, is it? And then I finished my C. (laughs) Okay, go ahead. Number four. All right, number four. The tiny part of a seed that can grow into a plant mm-hmm. is the A, spore, B, embryo, C, pistil, that's B-I-S-T-I-L, or D, fruit. <laughs> I love Can the you read, read, read the, the answers again? The sure. four. A, spore, uh-huh. B, embryo, 
C, pistil, and D, fruit. And pistil is P-I-S-T-I-L. Right. That's backwards. That's L-I-T-S-I-P. Lit sip. All right. All right. Pencils okay. down. Down. I said B. I said A. All right. The correct answer is B, embryo. <sighs> yeah! Yeah, one, one, totally okay. guessed that, fucker. <laughs> okay, continue. Not too bad. All right. Well, God, you guys are... The sweat. Number I can feel five. it. It's like hot with mental energy. Mm-hmm. All right. Uh, five. A magnetic field is the A, group of objects that a magnet affects. B, effect of magnets on an object. C, area around a magnet where the force acts. D, area near a magnet where there is no force. So a magnetic field is the... Pencils down. I got it. We're done. All right. Good. I said C. You said C. Crystal, what did you say? I said C. All right. And the correct answer is C. Good yeah, job. Yeah, I won. I won. Good I won. Job. I won. You didn't win if we both got it right. <laughs> All right. I got it right. <laughs> All right. I got it right. When the layer of air that surrounds the earth presses down, this is A, heat, B, air pressure, C, temperature, D, precipitation. Say it one more time. <laughs> when, when the layer, I know which one it is, but I forgot which <laughs> letter it was. I'm a, so fucked. Right, a, heat. Uh-huh. B, air pressure. C, temperature. D, precipitation. I know precipitation is when you sweat, right? I got it. It's, I got it's it. Any, I got any it, moisture. That's perspiration. I got it. I got it. Okay. All right. All right um, oh, wait, we'll I didn't get lady. it. What did you have? I didn't get it yet. Oh. Hold on. Well, when, when, when the... The layer of air pushes down? When the layer of air that surrounds the earth presses down, this is... Global warming was my choice. Global <laughs> warming. <laughs> okay. What are the, the letters again? A, heat. B, air pressure. C, Fair temperature. Nice. And D, precipitation. These all sound like Richard Gere or like okay. these okay. movies with like heist. I guess. Yes, I, I guess. guess. B, I guess uh, what I What'd said B. Yeah, I guess the obvious B. Good. You guys are both Yay! correct. Yay! I got it right! All right, excellent. I did it! I did it! All right. You can put this up on your fridge when you get home? Yes. Yeah, totally. Make copies so I can magnet it online. All right. Uh, a, a barometer measures A, precipitation, uh, B, air pressure, C, temperature, D, wind speed. What was the first one again? Pencils down. Precipic. Well, that's spelled wrong. Precipitation, but it's precipitation. What's the other one? B, air pressure, C, temperature, and D, wind speed. I would actually feel kind of weird about a, a quiz that has oh, typos wait. in it. Say it again. Okay. It's a barometer measures A, precipitation, B, air pressure, C, temperature, D, wind speed. Okay. Bar- which of the dials in a car is the barometer is my question. Your mom. Oh, There's right. a barometer in the car? <laughs> no, he's being, it's a Christian joke. <laughs> but the, your mom was a David <laughs> joke, so that works. <laughs> Okay, you're making me second guess myself. Oh, I, thought you, right. I saw you wrote it down. I did okay. write it down, but now, now I'm second guessing myself. All right, well, okay, pencils down. I guess A, what'd you guess? A. That's wrong. It's uh, air pressure. Damn it. I had that. See, I wrote B I had right that. There, I had I? that. Well, you wrote A, uh, B, and C, and D down. Yeah. So, what was, yeah, D, had, was, was D wind speed? <laughs> yeah, D is wind speed. I knew that, but people that always look at the barometer. That would have been my second guess, so I would have gotten it wrong anyway. <laughs> Why do people always Yay. look at the barometer for rain and shit like that and humidity? Well, because yeah. it's it's an indication of it when it's going to rain. Down, when there's air yeah. pressure, that means yeah. there's more right, there's more rain goblins in the sky that create buckets. That so then that 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 question about the the air pushing down equaling the air pressure could actually have been precipitation as well. Well, that's why it's down there because it's probably fairly related. Mm, and that's, tricky, yeah. tricky that's, little bastards. Yeah. If I were in fourth grade, I would fail. Yeah. Makes okay, me go stupid. Ahead. What kind of circuit allows a current to flow through it? A, open. B, magnetic. C, electron. D, closed. Done. All right. Uh, with the lady, we'll start. What, what? did you end? Why? Because you want to disparage me first? Mm-hmm. A, I put... D. Okay. It's D. It is D. I it's did it. I circuit. did it. I did it. It's closed because it has to connect. Close. It's closed and open. An open, uh, an open circuit. Yeah. Is, See, is... that's why I failed ninth grade science. Oh no! Wait, wait. I passed, <laughs> but not very <laughs> by very much. I think <laughs> okay. Canada has very low standards. So I, I think what, what's passing fifty. Fifty <laughs> percent. I think I got fifty. Fifty one. I think I got. Funny. I, yeah. I blew my my teacher in the back of it. I did. It. Never mind. <laughs> you don't want to know how I passed. All right. The time it takes for a plant to rotate. Uh, excuse me. The time it takes for a planet to rotate on its axis is one a year, b season, c month, d day. No, and no offense to anyone out there who has people who were killed in the military during D Day. 
I didn't know. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> D J. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Did Dave. you guess? I did. I David, guess. we're gonna D. go with you. All right. D. What'd you say? I said A. It's D. I did it. I it did is it. D-day. I did it. I did it. <laughs> Sorry. Can you stop covering your paper, David? This is not yeah, fair. Yeah, you, you got to give her the really answers. You're really making me look bad. <laughs> give her the I'm answers. just saying. <laughs> All right. Um, I'm smart. <laughs> well, right. I'm smarty, smarty, and I like to party. Oh, it's all relative. All right. Ten. What? Thanks. The flow, of en- <laughs> <laughs> the flow of energy and materials through food chains that are connected from. Uh, excuse me. The flow of energy and materials through food chains that are connected from a. Food web, food cycle, food order, or food source. I don't what? even know what you just said yeah, at I don't all. Know what you just said either. I have no clue what that what that just said. Yeah, I think scrutiny. that's. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm actually going to switch something else. All right. Yeah, yeah. don't do that. The question. That's a stupid okay. question. Which poles of two magnets will be attracted towards each other? All right. I just made an attracted pole joke, <laughs> so someone make it, something off of that. All right. Um, so, which poles of two magnets will be attracted towards each other? A. North and south. B, middle and north. C, south and south. D, north and north. I did it. I did it. I did it. Oh, Peter North would have been my joke. Sorry. Go Who's with David first. That's a. Safe I guessed A. What did you guess? Okay, I guessed A. All right, let's see. Yay, we won. Let me see. What do you mean, let me see? Oh, it is <laughs> north and south. I would have gone with north and north and north and north and north. All right, <laughs> but so the that, two same. They, they, yeah, they, they push yeah. apart. Opposites. That's where you I think that was school. second Opposites grade. Time. Track. Yeah. 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 Not too bad. All right. Which good. Well, um, there there are tons forward. of questions on here, so I'm not going to go through them Back. all. But that was uh, that was the first right. ten. I did the whole. So thing. So that's after ten. Okay. So next time you'll do ten more. Sure. Why not? But out of ten, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You know, we're, we're not keeping score here, David. <laughs> 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 this is not about how many you got or how smart you are. Okay. Well, what is it about? Wait. What is it about? This is for fun. Okay. This is actually the point I was going to make because I. Um, I got seven out of ten. I'm smarter than you. You are. You, are, you got. <laughs> you got okay. eight out of ten. I'm gonna shoot him in the face. <laughs> you got. You got. I, I. I. You know what? This goes under the Privacy Act. I think. No, it's. It's no, all right. No, you know what? If you want to know how many I got, the Privacy Act? then you. 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 You purchase this. This on uh, <sighs> iTunes, and then you rewind it. Okay. Uh, and that's such a good idea. <laughs> <laughs> well, my, my point was, my point was, this was a required uh, test. This is a uh, For fourth what? grade science level. This that is, was a fourth grade test? This is fourth grade. <laughs> this is a fourth grade test. Realize this has had us, had us sitting here thinking about it constantly. You know what, studying. though? We, if we would have learned it at the yeah. time and done it, because I remember I got 100% on all these. If we all three yeah. of us would have learned it at this time and then had the test, we would have gotten it. But I didn't. we haven't heard any of the shit since then. <laughs> exactly. That's right. And that's, that's been like 60 years for me. Yeah. yeah if I, it had been I like agree. a TV guide listing for me, I would have. Yeah. Would have been able to live 8 30 colombo whatever yeah exactly right, right, yeah. exactly yeah. yeah see i'm no, 54 years old so how old are you in the eighth grade in the fourth grade you're i was yeah, 21 Fourth, no 19 like so that's 44 years for me that's a whole person's <laughs> life yeah, yeah it's no, true it's, it's true. true i think i think if you're right if i had studied it and i yeah. was right there Right I there? kicked ass in school. Anyway, so yeah. my point, uh-huh. my point, it, my point by that, by, uh, yeah, no, by bringing no. that up, was that um, this was it's a required test in the fourth grade in New York State uh-huh. to take that, or at least New York City. It just says New York. Those New York kids don't get that to pass right. that a hundred percent. They I've had never talked to people in New had, York City. They're stupid. Yeah, they get had 100%? like eighty-two percent of kids of the fourth grade fourth graders uh, passed that a hundred percent. The the entire yeah. test. So I mean, it's when 50 questions. was that? Really? Like recently? This is it's the site is from 2006. So yeah, I think I it was recent. It. Really? Because mm-hmm. kids are stupid. Yeah, yeah. I know. Apparently, <laughs> so am I because I got yeah three yeah, it's, out of it's seven the, of the thing, first time. Well, I mean, this brings up a, a, a comment about the school system. I mean, we we learn all this stuff. I learned all that stuff, but retention, right? Yeah. I retained. I won't say what percentage <laughs> of it. Very small percentage. <laughs> a lady never tells. Right. So. <laughs> So the thing is, you know, it's it's all about application. Yeah. You know, showing showing kids stuff that they're actually going to use yeah. in their life or how to apply it. Yeah. How, even if they told, I probably could could actually use at least half of that stuff in my life now. You could? If I was told how to use it. Wow. I mean, oh, I see do you know what I mean? Yeah, like yeah. if somebody... I'd have a big old barometer on my wall. I'd right. Be like, yeah. Yes, you actually could. And, and so. you could, instead of going on to, you know, weather.com, you could actually check your barometer and well, see what... what 
things were going to look like. Yeah, what they really need to do up, is so. teach people how to drive and how to get out of the <laughs> fucking fast lane on the freeway so I can get places where I want to go. That's what they need to teach it kids. I got a little specific. Instead, no. of, <laughs> instead of teaching us the theory behind circuits, if they actually taught us how to rewire do you hear those ominous a lamp or something. Like, yeah, I they need to teach us how to rewire a lamp. Rewire a lamp. That, I think that well, was question number 12. How do you re- do <laughs> unplug it first? Do you be? Yeah, no, I agree. <laughs> Well, um, uh, just I had a slight segue, uh, an inconsequential segue. I think we're done with that, right? We all realize we, we all we all realize segue on we're stupid yeah. than most fourth graders. We all agree. Yes. We're dumber than most fourth graders. Well, um, yeah, I was just before I came here, I went to Seven Eleven, and while I was in line, I saw a a porn star. <gasps> I recognized one? the which porn one? star at our Seven Eleven, right there. Yeah, it, it's right, right which on the one? corner. Which right, porn by store? The wow. Um, He's well, going to th- say, like... This is the thing. It was a dude, and I'm not <gasps> even kidding. I'm tr- I was just on the net. Is it gay search- or straight porn, straight, Christian? Straight. Straightish. Straight. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. What's the porn star's name? I'm trying to remember his name. It's not Mark Davis. It's, um... It's Dark Mavis. <laughs> there you go. It's Gork Mormon. Dark Mavis is, like, my super <laughs> superhero character. <laughs> Anyways, la, but la, I, felt, la, la. I felt this instant, like... Hey, I know you! Like, you know, if you saw your favorite movie star or something like that, you want to go... No, I didn't, because he looked really annoyed. And plus, I'm always intimidated talking to people with big penises. That's why I never look Mark Garvin in the eye. I'm looking at him in the eye right now. Which one? (laughs) What does that tell you? (laughs) What? (laughs) Yeah. Anyways, I just thought that was interesting, because I was like, you know what? Porn stars are people, too. Because he he went there, he's And he's in, up here in Tahunga. Yeah, and, well, I hear this is a hotbed of pornographic activity. What up? It is? Tahunga? Well, this is where people come to film horse porn, is what I hear. We're in Tahunga Beach. Okay. I can see that. There's a lot of horses around. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, wow. Yeah, I would go. like to see before I die a porno being filmed. I've never seen really? it. Really? I would think it would be Just to see boring. it really quick and then leave. Yeah, I'm sure it's boring, but I don't want to get close enough to smell it because I'd throw up. <laughs> oh. Well, it that's why you got. I don't want to smell other no. people having sex at all. That would just make me throw up. Coated in strawberry. Although blue. I was in a room once where two lesbians were making love in and, a and hotel that room, and divine. Yeah, it was pretty good. Can lesbians make love? Well, they scissor kick. <laughs> <laughs> they bite. They use their knuckles. They Ooh. use their their ankles. They that's use all what, kinds of. How long were you watching, David? <laughs> that reminds- no, I heard about this. It, I was I was watching up until they turned off the lights, and then they said, "If you jump across, we're gonna bite your penis off." So wow, I just kind of did it, and then we were like really. It was it was a hundred years ago. It was in the seventies, so oh, okay. we were drunk, that's and then really I passed cool. out. It was like an orgy. Type so they thing. might not have been lesbians. They might just. Have oh no, been. they got it on. No, one was a full lesbian because when we first met this girl, it was a girl friend uh, not a, not a girlfriend but a friend who was a girl and me mm-hmm. and i was like wow that girl's really cute look at her she's like all like with a t-shirt and is like no that's a boy like that boy's <laughs> really cute she said and then we had a fight and then we went up and talked to her and it was you know, actually someone told we're like who is that and they said jet was the name and we're like oh, that, that could be a boy or a girl that's true or a black so magazine very funny yeah. or a black <laughs> magazine that what that's this funny. was in the 70s so i don't think jet was around no they didn't like those about those people <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Damn it! I had a good joke. All right, Mark, just oh, to man. just to bring you in, I'm gonna warm up the crowd with a joke. Um, you know what you call a, a lesbian with fat fingers? What popular? Well, well hung. Well hung. <laughs> Thought that was funny. Well hung. Continue That's one on. thing I I learned early Moving in my life. I was like 17 on. when I learned that lesbians have to clip their fingernails really short all the time. Anyone does. I mean, you have to keep your fingernails clean if you're. Well, girls don't. You would just gonna suck be the dirt out from underneath them. No, no, they have to keep <laughs> them really short because Christian they might set. scrape inside the vagina. Or of course, mm-hmm, there mm-hmm. with their big long fingers. That is very stuff. nice of them. <laughs> uh-huh. Hey, Mark, let me yeah. see. Your and fingers. here's Garth Marvin with the sports report. <laughs> <laughs> nice segue, Peter. Awesome. <laughs> Thank you. Wait, before we get into the sports report, I have to bring up something. There is a secret at the table. What? Is it? Someone has a secret. You know, I'm wondering if I have else. a secret. I, I don't know what's going on. I know someone on. <laughs> has a secret that I discovered from someone else, and if I say it, there might be a fight or there might not. So I want a uh-uh. show of hands to see if we should vote to see if uh, we oh, should, if I should expose who has, the, who secret. Has the secret. Keep the secret. I'm scared. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's vote. Who wants to tell the secret? I, want, I don't have anything hair. to hide. Okay. Yay! <laughs> one, two, three, four against one. <laughs> <laughs> Uh-oh. Actually, I don't even know it's a secret because of what was said earlier. I don't know if it's a secret anymore. Is Crystal going down? No, it's not Crystal. <laughs> I, yeah, I Let's know. try oh. to guess who has a secret and who will be mad at the secret. Is it me? Oh, my me? God. Do you still need me on the podcast? Because I could totally be playing WoW right now. <laughs> no, you're going to do your segment <gasps> in a good minute, idea. Stool, but you might be the uh, one who has a secret okay. or you might be the one wait, who wait, I have a question. gets mad. The, the person who's mad, do they have a microphone? 
Yes. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay, so okay. that just cut out two people. Okay. The person who has yeah. a secret so, has a microphone, and the person who is mad. I'm going to think that Mark so it's you, is going to get mad because you like it when Mark gets mad. Isn't Mark cute when he gets mad? <laughs> <laughs> then who has a secret? I've never seen him mad. Then I guess I can't it's Christian if it's not me. Yes, Christian has a secret, and oh. Mark might get mad. <laughs> Mark, I did your mom. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Mark's like, it had to be done. It had to be Joke's done. on you, buddy. <laughs> oh, oh welcome to the world of oh HIV. Oh, I don't even know if it's a secret anymore, but it was when Peter and I were talking, it was fun drama. Is it a secret anymore? You fun mean? drama is an oxymoron. Remember when we voted whether or not we would discover the secret and so then you just tell? kept fucking talking? <laughs> Oh wait, no, sorry. Oh, I, I it's don't. Called build, I, it's called dramatic. I don't build remember up. that. I just it's totally called, spaced out. <laughs> yeah, good idea. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's just that I guess you drove yourself here today, didn't you, Christian? No, Mark took me. Oh, so should I tell the secret or no? <gasps> what are you talking about? Let's do sports I'm report. I'm so confused. Uh, yeah, I'm well, confused. Well, Christian too. has a car. He's but taking he, away too. He forced you to drive him here. Really? <laughs> yeah. And is, I don't know why. Is that what happened? <laughs> yeah. Is that how it went? Is that didn't happen? Yeah, it totally happened. happened? Let's get on with the sports report. Here's uh, Mark Gisman. Sports report. No, we, we just we just wanted to call you out for. We just to wanted bring to up, watch bring you up some shitty, to shitty bring ass up drama. Garbage. Yeah. Fucking <laughs> drama that you're creating out of nothing. Just so stuff. then, what happened then? I drove here. Happened. He drove so here with his own goddamn car, car and oh, we okay. said, "We said, watch, David Drader's gonna, gonna be a bring douche. it up. He's gonna totally bring it up. Don't cross me, Peter. Peter told me to bring it up, and <laughs> Peter said, "Do it on the podcast. Do it on the podcast." <laughs> yeah, that was that, that, <laughs> that was, was, was kind of anticlimactic. I think. Oh he's yeah, it was anticlimactic <laughs> before it started. Wait, had had he tricked you into driving him, would you be mad at him? I would have bought him a beer, uh, no. and he would have been See, like, oh, yeah. he, 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 always, he would have bought you a beer, and then forget it. It would have been fine. Mark, you, you, just, he, you just pet him and feed him chocolate. He's okay. I'm yeah. going to find out a really Pretty good much. secret, though, and I'm going to reveal it. Okay. You should cool. do that. Yeah, find a secret about hey, me. Yes, Crystal, if Mark and Peter made love while you were gone in Canada, that wouldn't be a secret, would it? You mean no. again? Oh, yeah, Ooh. forget it. That's not a secret. Ooh. Damn, I can't Peter, where are you going? No, man, don't leave. It's all good. There's two... Unattended. All right, here's Gark Marvin with the sports report. Hey, buddy, what's going on? Hey, guys. All right. How is hey, the ride, sport? buddy. <laughs> beep, beep. <laughs> oh, oh, my goodness. Passenger. <laughs> <laughs> Hot potato. David, you're an idiot. <laughs> so here's. Shut up! Peter told me to do it. I got tricked into it. Peter manipulated me. Mm-hmm. Oh, too bad no That's one else. That's how I got is. pregnant. <laughs> yeah. Twice or once? Hey, yeah, just yeah. once. He manipulated your uterus. Okay, so right, tricked me. Ahead. Okay, so here's 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 my thing. I just realized something. I was downstairs. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm really sorry. This says. Person, place, or thing, 10 minutes. Drama, 10 minutes. <laughs> it's a list of, a to-do list, list for the it's podcast. It's David's plan. <laughs> oh <my laughs> awesome. So, I like how it's only going to last 10 minutes. So he's got a guarantee. 10 minutes, <laughs> ten, ten minutes of drama. Oh, so, we're behind. We, we still got more. Come, come on, going. you got to hurry up with the sports okay, reporter. We're not gonna have it's time my for fault. Drama. Go. Okay, here's the dealio. <laughs> Yo, there's the dealio. I was dealio. downstairs mm-hmm. waiting for my segment to come up. Mm-hmm. I uh, was watching Charlotte's Web. Okay. Did you come up with a new game? No, sort of. (laughs) It is a new game. (laughs) Now, I was realizing. So, okay. So, you know, there's there's the goose, you know, and she has her goslings, right? And all the other animals are, oh, my God, it's little goslings. How cute. Amazing. There was a runt gosling. And then the pig Wilbur was like, oh, my God, I was a runt too once, right? (laughs) And then the gosling walks up to him and goes, hi, I'm Ryan. a little child Jewish voice. Oh, are you my mother? Yikes. And I realized. <laughs> Circumcised that duck. This <laughs> goose. Too. Hold on. Oh. I realized that. Does it. Does it. Okay. Oh. Does anyone else ever notice that in cartoons there's always like a little animal of some sort or a family member of an animal, like a, like another animal's brother or sister, that always has that little Jewish voice. Okay, it's to make up for all the injustices we've done. To it the Jews. must be it's true. It's we true. did that we did, but would well, have been ironic. Hollywood like, did. It's true. I agree because they do have. I mean, and a lot of people Jews. are character voices. But what would have been ironic is if Wilbur had that voice. <laughs> I think that would have been funny. Yeah, that would have been funny. Why? Because pig. they don't. That, pig. They don't there you go. Touche. Oh, we just oh, need to say David's, that out loud. David's quick. <laughs> Write that down. <laughs> hey, why are you guys 
is attacking me. Hey, Mark, can I get a ride home since you drove, drove me here? Sure, bro, no home. problem. You guys are so the seat's in. still warm. It's cool, in. right? I have a but car, sure. so it's cool, right? I'm not like pissing Sarah, you off. I don't want to start any sure. drama. Wrote it down. <laughs> don't want more drama. <laughs> so wait, what? What does that have to do with sports? No, 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 no. Listen. Oh, sorry. You missed my point. Mm. There was a point. Is th- I think there needs to be some sort of a like a like a like a like a the game a game show kind of game about different cartoons that have the little Jewish character in them. How long would that mm. game last? Like, find ones? Like, right, no, like, 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 like one of those um, box sets. Yeah. Like a, like a DVD like a tr- box set. Like a trivial little, pursuit. Little oh, Jewish gotcha. cartoon box like, set. Okay. Yeah. Monsters, <laughs> Monsters, Monsters, Inc. Like a collection. Inc. Like Monsters, Inc. Monsters, Inc. There's a Jew. Okay. Billy Crystal's it, basically no, Jewish, right? The, the, the Billy Crystal's uh, boss yeah. in that movie, that old raggedy looking. Oh, well, oh and you do your paperwork kind of mm-hmm. voice. Ross. Yeah, yeah, but she's more like New Jersey. Whatever. Mm-hmm. Oh, the Jersey? only one I can Jew? think of is Hold is on South Park with Stan's <laughs> cousin, or is it Kyle's cousin? But he comes? is a Jew. Yeah, I know, yeah. but like oh, that's his family's count. Jewish. He is a little Jew. See, but <laughs> then like, again, why's he got a Jewish voice? Does it count? Black voice. <laughs> Yo, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go to the synagogue. Does it count? Well, because Jews rule the world, and they're all—they all got jobs in that whole industry. So they hired a Jew and got him in there and do the do your voice, and it was no, a Jewish voice, right, right? But I'm just saying it's interesting uh-huh. that there's always that little. So it's not. It's, it's not anti-Semitism. It's just. Well, it's just like in, in just about every commercial you see, like it, like when happy people say, for instance, like a car commercial, there's going to be a black guy, an Asian, a, you know, a black girl. Mm. And then Why do they call that? Yeah. They call that the Marsha Brady phenomenon because the mm. first time it appeared on TV is every time Marsha Brady would have a party or a collection of friends, there would always be a redhead, a black, a Mexican, uh, yeah. uh, what do you call, what do you call chinks? What do you call him? Oh, my God. No, no, you got it. For me. That'll do. And a carry little, on. And a little spit girl. And no, don't carry on. Like Why'd you tell him to carry on? Because he's going Shut to anyway. Uh, you got to teach him. me, Crystal. I don't know what they're called. What's the proper term for chink? Okay. Uh, now, back to my sports board. I actually Crystal, do have a little bit of news. I do have a little bit of news. Good, so shut your fucking mouth. Let's do it. Mouth. Let's do it. You. Shut your drama shit mouth and let me fucking talk. Thank it's my you. fucking sports How report. How dare you? I do. Drama shit. go ahead. I love you. That's fine. <laughs> I love you too. I'm petting your right, left arm, ahead. shoulder, you physical contact. All right, now here's the deal. I actually today just talked to a guy who has a friend who does like professional street racing. Oh wow! Um, and uh, they might invite me to film some of their street races. Oh, that's nice. right. So uh, just as Do an actual sports report, no, but I can drive. <laughs> Wait, professional <laughs> drive and hold the camera. Professional the legal time. or illegal? Street races. It's illegal. Yeah, it's not street legal. Races street are racing not legal. is general, not legal. Know. But it's been banned. They've shut down raceways wow. where they could actually but go and race arrested. and stuff. You so there's this guy I mean, with like 10 of his good, close, like professional racer friends, not like kids with Hondas and shit. Mm-hmm. And they go and they like scope out locations and they. You get arrested. What are you mm-hmm. going to do? e rest is I'm what happens run. when you go to jail online. <laughs> e rest it. it's, it's for trolling trolling young girls on the internet. I think. What are yeah. you going to do? You could get arrested. What are you going to do? Well, I don't know. I'm just saying. You got to hide in the bushes to do it. I haven't no, run. What you say is, I, I was filming it. It's like Rodney King. I just wanted to make sure. I just oh, caught the show on film. Check yeah. it out. Yeah. You can I, have, I have an alibi. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. I, I was at home. And then you're the narc who turns <laughs> I wasn't them all there. in. <laughs> yeah. yeah, and then they break into your house. Yeah. Oh, wow. But no, I'm not. What a, anyway, I, I just figured I'd I'd shoot that out there because it's actual. Yeah, we need a report on that when you do it. Of some kind. That's awesome. I'd really like to see that. I mean, that'd be kind of fun. Via video. I'm sure TV. that our viewers right. would like to see it as well. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, yeah. I, I guess know. we can't right. say where it's going to be, well, can we? No, but I mean, I could you give a report on it. I'm After saying, a video, a few, we could webcast it somewhere. We could on YouTube. Wait, is you know it what? on the internet? Like, do people know I'm the I'm looking for job security here, people. Job security. I'm trying to form a good spot. Did you do that at one point? Security? I did. So I got this? $6 an hour. Wow. Awesome. <laughs> and worked 120 hours a week. What oh, do you do now? What's place. your job now? God. You sell big, huge things. Oh, big I do things. porn. Yeah. Porn. He sells big stuff. He porn. That's what that's really? slang for porn. <laughs> he sells it over and over. <laughs> <Like> <laughs> porn. I told you I saw a porn star at, uh, at, at 7-Eleven, 7-Eleven, right? Coincidentally, yeah. I was at 7-Eleven. It was Garth yeah, it's funny. It's funny. funny how that works that out. That should be your porn name, by Did the way. Did I tell you I got you Marvin? Just to mask it so nobody knows it's right. you. What's his name? I said his his porn name should be Gark Marvin. Gark Marvin. I thought his name could figure it out. His porn star name should be 7-Eleven because he's open all night long. Oh. But 7-Eleven isn't really all night long. But then he goes from 7 
11, know, went to 11, 11. But it ended up being 24 hours. God, so couldn't should we just, just call do it the math? I think it was seven days it, a week, 11 hours a day. Yeah, yeah. But now, yeah, now they're open 24 hours a day. Yeah, so it should be called 24. But then that's kind of copyright seven, infringement 20, on the show. Yeah, we can, they should call so. it 24 7. 24 they used to be Oh, open? that's good. You should open your own your own convenience right. store. Yeah, I would have Wait, no competition. They used to only be open 11 right. hours because as long as I've been alive, they've been open 24 hours. And no, I've been alive a really When long I was time. a kid, they closed at like midnight. <laughs> really? But that was Canada, right? Canada? Yeah. Or when when did. They, yeah, maybe it was, wasn't midnight. I forget when it was. But I remember them closing oh, weird. at yeah. night. My like when I was a kid, they, I mean the bums were still there till like six in the morning. What does everybody like, think of Seven Eleven? I was a kid. Seven Eleven was a treat. Road, like so. I was like I would flip 7-Eleven out when I got awesome. to Seven Eleven. When I okay, I just went back to the the town I I grew up in, uh-huh. and the Seven Eleven is gone, like mm. boarded up, gone. How could Seven Eleven go out of business? There was another convenience mm. store across the street that won. I wow. can't believe that any other convenience store would win over Seven Eleven. Did 7-11. you go in that convenience store to see? My mind is boggling. That's so yeah, awesome. Yeah, I mean it was fine, but <laughs> how epic does a convenience it's store gone. have to be to outsell Seven Eleven? But you I know, know Famima, that Famima thing is awesome. I love that place. The what? The Who? Famima thing. It's Isn't like that it's a bone a, in your leg. It's a convenience <laughs> store, but it looks like <laughs> yes, a it is. Memer. But it looks like a European. Take convenience me to your store. convenience store. I've never it's seen it. Bitch in as hell. You have to take me. They're only in like there's one in Pasadena. On you can't take me to Pasadena. Yeah, let's go. I'll take it. I'll oh, take shit. it. I'll take it. There's one in Pasadena, <laughs> Colorado, and there's one in Hollywood on Santa Monica. It reminds me of Farina, the the hot cereal. Yum. I'd like yeah. to eat some of that right it now. It reminds me of spirulina. It's like baby food. Sp- no, mm-hmm. it doesn't. Sort of. Yeah. <laughs> um, but I actually that's think funny of because you I went lie. to I went to Denmark. I was in Denmark for about four months, and not. they have uh, they have Seven Eleven in Denmark. They do. Maybe. Yes, they do. But the thing is, it's owned by a Norwegian company. It's not affiliated. They bought it like a um, like they would a buy a chain. You know. A franchise. franchise, yeah, there you go. But they have like, it's like when you go to a candy store, you know how they have buckets and buckets of candy you can buy the by the pound. They have that there, and they have like the hot dogs and stuff there. But they're actually good, relatively good. Oh. But they put mayonnaise yeah, on everything. In, it's like totally different. They have TVs everywhere. It's awesome. Totally. And in yeah. England, they have big signs that say "Candy Floss," like five pence. Do you know what guys what Candy Floss is? Yes, indeed. Yes. Kind of yeah, no. like, don't you say it, this don't before. I call it candy know. floss all the time. And you oh, you guys call it in Canada? Yeah. You call it candy floss? Oh, I, call, I was flipped out. I How'd you know? Lucas, I hear my mommy with the money report. Oh. Thank you, Mark. All right, Maybe so so that conversation is dead in the water. Yeah. So, okay. So here, <laughs> I, I, I said mommy report. It was sort of a Bye, loose Get out. Uh, general title for it okay. yeah um so really what i have this week is more of, of, a, of a discussion Uh-oh. what i'm wondering it's, it's a discussion about body fluid oh because okay. here's my question ever since i had a had a baby not too long ago mm-hmm. i've been noticing there's this this thing about body fluid mm. for example your baby spits up on you oh yeah and you're like oh my baby spat up on me no big deal I'll just wipe it off mm. when it's your kid if yeah. it were someone else's kid you'd be like ew gross this thing just puked on me get it off i'm taking a shower <laughs> right yeah um you you chew food yeah and you start maybe choking or for some reason you need to spit it out mm-hmm. you never want to put that food back in your mouth why because mm. it's covered with your own spit yet you take your gum out of your mouth and then you'd put it back in and you'll kiss somebody. Mm-hmm. You're getting their spit oh God, in their mouth. Totally However, them, yeah. it, you wouldn't open your mouth and let somebody just hawk in your mouth. I pay good money right? for that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Except for, for Christian, but yeah. nobody else. <laughs> right? So how come there's <sighs> these certain stigmas? Like your own body fluid is gross. You're not allowed to touch your own body fluid. Like you, like if you spat in your hand, you wouldn't lick it off your hand, right? You That's know what? Gross. It's true. I was riding my bike the other day and I spit and it went on my arm and I was grossed out. <laughs> yeah. And then I wiped it off and I was like, oh, okay, no big deal. And two seconds later it was dry and I was like, why was I grossed out? But I was grossed out. Right. But it's your own spit. I had a friend. She would literally find a hair, one of her own hairs uh-huh. on her food and get grossed out and like not eat that food. But she would pull a hair out of her head and floss with it. That's what I was going to say. Ew! Who is, is it? Okay? What's her name? What's her name? I hate I, her. I What's her name? I knew someone who would do that. He was, he was an ex-military guy who would, who would take he would out floss his hair. With and his hair? It was short hairs, too. It wasn't like he had long hair. It was like short hairs and he'd go... What's his name? <laughs> I hate him, too. What's his name? <laughs> Gerald. What's Gerald? your friend's name? Jerry. Samantha. I hate Samantha mm-hmm. and Gerald. And, yeah. yeah, I hate them. Did, I thought that was... Yeah, that is gross. Because I told but what I didn't understand is it's like pick one, right? Yeah. Either your hair is disgusting or it's not disgusting and you wash it on a regular basis. That like 
you can't have your hair fall into your food, go, ew, it's gross, and, and then, then pull one them? out of your head and floss with it. I you agree. know, sure. I don't understand. There's well, it's also like it's also, and this is getting really disgusting. But like when you go to the bathroom number two, mm-hmm. you that's, can look wait, at wait, it in what the is toilet. That? Is that, mm-hmm. That's poop, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, <laughs> you can look at it in the toilet and flush it and whatever. But it went like in France. I went in after somebody, and it was somebody I even knew, and I opened up the toilet to go to. The and they, there was some in there and I flipped out I couldn't go to the bathroom and then I s- screamed and jumped through a plate glass window but it was like yeah like you can look at your own eh, big deal but yeah. someone else's it flips you out yeah yeah to a degree I don't know because speaking as a kid who used to pick his nose and eat his boogers oh like yeah I, I that was you. I yeah, will never French was kiss you ever as long Again. as I live. you've made that <laughs> promise once or twice let's 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 hold to it but uh, I, uh, I used to it was just habitual oh god wait. I can't even I imagine can't even. how I do it now but it was uh, <laughs> uh no don't I, I know it in up. studio I just started picking my nose I'll throw up I will I'll throw up I will I'll throw up and I just ate a whole bunch of dinner too so you uh-huh. Crystal do you really want me to throw up in I, I don't really else? no we don't want to see your bodily fluids anyway, if you that'll could make just us throw move up move it to the bathroom that'd be great <laughs> but I don't know, make it but yeah that, that kind of brings up an interesting interesting subject because I uh, got got kind of uh, upset with a friend of mine uh, I guess the weekend before last or before that and I was drunk I, I i was pretty drunk and i got pissed at him and i um he yeah he pissed me off did you go in your room and start eating your burgers <laughs> <laughs> that would have been actually much much more favorable so i so I, I walked away but as i walked away i spit on his back like i actually just full-on spit you were that on him. mad at him who yeah was i was it? really who was it off. say the person's first name um was it david it was gerald <laughs> <laughs> come on who was it who was it? Just say the person's first name. No one you know come on you gotta bring up some oh, so okay anyway for the drama section uh, of, uh, so what, what was uh, so what and he, he had no reaction whatsoever. He was Did just he, like, he didn't get pissed off. Was he so drunk no. he didn't notice he spat on his back? He was not drunk. I mean, I don't know. I mean, I'm sure he noticed, but uh, <laughs> but, but it's, you're it not about to out yourself on the podcast. <laughs> yeah. you're saying. Wait, did you guys just make in up? case he didn't notice? There's <laughs> yeah. no point in saying his not name. Not going to say his name. Oh, wait, <laughs> did you guys make up? Or no? the radar. Yeah, we made out a little bit after that. <laughs> <laughs> is that the question? But then he was fine. Yeah, he was fine taking your slime into his mouth. The spit on his back, he didn't like. Right, but the spit in his mouth is okay. Well, maybe he thought it was something else. I don't know what else. Ew. There's one bodily fluid that, if I even see in a picture, I've never been in the same room with it before ever. Is it semen? Yeah, I start to gag. I can't even. I don't even want to. <laughs> what do you mean? David, David, you are sitting on a pouch of semen right now. Shut up. No, I'll you. throw up. He gags whenever he sees semen. No, seriously. Because I was sitting with my friend at the at the computer, and her boyfriend sent her over. He's like, hey, I, there's this picture I think is really hot. What? I know. It was so disgusting. It's like he, it's like a box of chocolates, but he just came no, on No, them. no, 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 no. It's, it's on. He sent it over on this woman's face, was covered in it. <sighs> and I started. <laughs> <laughs> and we were at this desk where I couldn't move. And she was cracking up. And I was like, I'm going to throw up. And then she finally handed me her thing. And I and I threw up a little, just a little okay. spittle. But her then purse, I got away. her cup. No, she <laughs> handed me a, um, a garbage can. Gotcha. Oh, gotcha. Wow. Yeah. But she thought it was funny until I was oh, going to throw was, up that on was, a rug. It was semen? Yeah, was all I, over this I was woman's right. face. Yeah. Wow. Well, that's kind of So gross, anytime you but... see semen, you, you want to throw up? Yeah, it makes me so sick. I... You don't get laid very often then, huh? <laughs> <No>. <laughs> well, I've never been in the... No, my own I'm semen, it would be fine. But if oh, it was someone okay. else's semen, oh, well, I see, would that throw up. Left out. <laughs> it's a good qualification <laughs> there. And if I... No, no, no. And if I smelled someone else's, I think I might... I will. Die. Are we back on? <laughs> what? <laughs> shit, shit, shit. Say die again. Douchebag. I would die. Oh my god, yeah. No, that totally reminds me of this thing before the <laughs> podcast shut off. Uh, that, that, there was... Um, trees. Uh, there are trees in, in LA that smell like yes. semen. They do. You yes. Yes. And it trees? actually, it, it does. It's like... Semen grove. There yeah. is. It used to be on the way to our school and these... I remember I was in like the fourth grade or sixth grade or something <laughs> like that and these kids would all laugh, the ha, 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 and they were in junior high mm-hmm. and we never got it until later on we were in high school and then we understood and then mm-hmm. we were like, oh. Wouldn't it be horrible to find out that there's just a bunch of like hobos camped out there having all sorts of crazy <laughs> wild No, but it's just... only during... It's only during like s- in Are September. Are you guys like... the same grove Yeah, it is. It's it's like summer no, summer into fall. I don't know what tree it is, but it's either blooming or rotting and dying it, it yeah. smells like wow it's wow. gross it's, it's huh. a cock tree it is gross and i have no i don't ever want people that are into like scatological stuff or anything Ooh, like that i don't ever want yikes. them in my house i don't want to meet what do you mean them. scatological like people that like to have sexual experiences with people pooping on them and stuff like mm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. i would i uh, 
Gross. Do not, do One not. Cup? I, 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 I do Eat not. And I, I, I'll throw up. I'll throw up. To anyone in the audience, I swear you better not go to the website www. <laughs> two the number two girls. <laughs> The number one cup dot com. No, Do I don't not ever want to see that, that. ever. That's oh, the, once again. Up. Did I'll you send up. that to Peter? Well, I'll throw up. Somebody I'll throw did. Up. Someone throw very childish and horrible up. sent that to Peter. Mm-hmm. I, I will think throw up. I'll throw up. I'll throw up. That's I'm disgusting. a wussing because that stuff. Yeah, all but, that kind of stuff. I'll throw up. But, but okay. I'll throw okay, up. Yeah, okay. we, we heard you. <laughs> but blood doesn't bother me for some reason at all. Well, on to the strange body fluid thing. Blood bother blood blood. Wait. Blood 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 I don't want other me. people's blood touching me, but it doesn't bother me if I see them bleeding or something. I don't like the taste of my own blood. Ooh. Well, it's, it's not too bad. It I tastes don't know if rusty. I taste it that it much. Tastes, it tastes metallic. I don't, yeah, I don't yeah like mine it. tastes metallic too. Like if I bite my tongue, I'm like hanging uh, it out of my mouth. I just, yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> you taste other people's blood? Whatever. Mark's half vampire. <laughs> He's also have rock star, so that makes him list. Oh wait, that's right. That brings me to an interesting thing. I need you to get pregnant again, actually, Crystal. Mm. I need you oh, to get I'm pregnant. Oh, I'm sure she'll do it because of that. <laughs> no, because what I found out is there's a hormone in pregnant women's urine uh-huh. that is really good for um, fat burning, and it and it and it and it and it burns all your fat off, and it and it helps you increase your muscle mass and stuff like that. For some reason, I don't know why. You want to so drink? I need you to get pregnant, and I need your urine. I'm you so wanna, mad that I didn't find out when you were Wait, wait. Pregnant. Do you want to drink my urine? No, no, no. I, you have to go to a doctor and, and they pour do it on your face. It has to be injected and then you send into a my picture. blood stream. Uh, now I heard oh something, my God. I heard something Are... about that with cat urine. No, cat urine does something else. No, I heard I heard that that it'll break down this third layer. Okay, Peter's mom was telling me this whole thing about there's this book and da da, da and they'll break yeah, down. Yeah, Peter's mom was. Yeah, just that's the book me. I'm it was, talking it was about. Tell- yeah. it, it, it'll, it's the same guy who did that other book. Yeah, yeah, Kevin, yeah. Kevin, Kevin, what's yeah, his name? Yeah, he's crate in the Adelbrains, okay. but yeah. So it's close, not better oh line, but the other Hercules. one. Oh my God, Hercules! Yeah, Kevin, um, oh, you'd know his so name awesome. if we said it. He's the Kevin. infomercial king. Get through the chopper. Anyway, so wait, it's cat urine, but it has to be pregnant, though, right? It was no, I don't think so. I think it was just cat urine. I have tons of cats. This is the thing that I don't understand. It, you inject it into yourself to, to, and it helps you get rid of that third layer of fat or something like that. Yeah, yeah. Third kind of fat that's yeah, yeah. really hard to get rid of. And it Here's increases my question. muscle mass, yeah. If it's that freaking hard to get rid of, ever think the body needs it? I don't, I don't care. Know. I don't care. I'm 150 like, years old. I've got, I've got hair all over my body that I can't always get rid of. Yeah. So I don't know if my body what? really Your needs it. Your body's trying to keep, you, <laughs> keep yourself warm. Look at how skinny I you are. It needs to keep heater. you warm. I have a space what? heater. Yeah. But wait, I have tons of cats, but how do I get my cats to pee into the hypodermic needle? <laughs> <laughs> Wow. You have to pee into a cup, and then I, you. <laughs> how do I get your cat to pee into a cup? Actually, what you do is you, you just aim. Hold it for a you, while. you aim for the bladder through the stomach. You, you just... probably use a catheter. <laughs> my cat. Catheter. Ooh, my cat. No, nothing. A like catheter. Cat. There you go. Thanks. No, I know, but my cats. How do I get them to pee into a catheter? Well, you stick a catheter inside their penis. <laughs> oh God, that's so sad. <laughs> or the vagina. You mean a boy cat or, or a girl vagina, cat? You can do. Because you know, I read that it was only women, a pregnant women's urine. So I, I could really, be wrong. Really, really need you to get a pregnant. What herself. I have is hearsay. So I can't did believe... you read the book? No, I didn't. So now I have two hearsays. Wait, but I got it offline. Hearsay. I read. I read. You no, you know, I read hearsays? an excerpt of the book from yeah. online. But he's so mm-hmm. stupid because he's like, you can lose ten pounds in one day, and people lose like forty pounds in one week. And I was like, what? no, I was like, yeah, how do you do that? Like it no, they you. get colonics. You can lose 10 pounds during one colonic because it flushes your system out. But it's like, fuck you. You can also right. donate a fat. liver or an organ or something like oh. that. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. But, no, uh, but what I'm saying is like, he's you like, can lose totally eight natural. pounds by cutting your head off. <laughs> That's eight pounds? Actually, he's, got, <laughs> <laughs> he's got a very svelte head. <laughs> so <laughs> I think we're looking <laughs> at six and a half. I'm going to get 10 colonics and see if I lose 80 pounds. We'll see. That'd be awesome. Like all in a row. Yeah. And then you have to do a report after each one. I'm going to do the colonic report. It'd be funny going in for your eighth one and your spine shoots out your the clonic report. I'm Horrible. totally getting. I'm gonna get six clonics in a row every other day it's oh. in like in October. It'll be breakfast, it. lunch, colonic. Ooh. They're, and they're October is fun. National Colonic Month. Yeah. Are you serious? No. <laughs> <laughs> I think she means for. <laughs> wow. It's, it's, Oh. The app, no, no, they do this thing where they put hot fudge in the colonic because it to taste oh. good. Like it's to it taste good. good, it goes in your bone. That's horrible you can taste because it. I mean, have you ever had a colonic? You can no. taste it. residual Ew. crap coming what? up as well. You can't taste oh. it. <laughs> That's no. horrible. What? I'm kidding. No. Never heard that no, 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 you no. can't taste it. I'm kidding. You can't taste it. But I have had. <laughs> Garlic put in it, and you can taste the garlic. You can fully taste Ew. the garlic. Oh, that's what... But do you know that your hot fudge comment reminds me? Have you seen Hot Fuzz? Yeah. No, I want to. Though I, I saw love that. that. I love those that movies. Was really Have you guys good seen movie. Super Rad? I right. want to see that. Okay. Super Bad. No, because no, okay. Really Excellent segue. That. But I just need to say, I just like you to acknowledge the fact that you have a problem with human semen, but no problem with feline urine. 
Can you admit that? I've never touched feeling urine. Oh, no, really I don't like feeling point. urine. And no, my no, cat's but you're, you're willing to have upset, urine but. injected into your body, yet you yeah. won't look at. Could you imagine semen? someone injecting semen into your body no, through your mouth? Wait, wait, wait! I can, I can imagine. Hold on! I totally missed. Wait, that. wait! wait yeah, a I got it. Okay. <laughs> I totally missed that. I heard all I heard was mouth, and I think he said something bad. <laughs> but wait, I don't want feeling urine. She wants me to get feeling urine. I want her pregnant urine. That's what I want. So another person's urine is fine to be. To the doctor, the doctor's gonna inject it. It's totally. not gonna taste it. Doctor puts something in you, it's fine. Doctor's That's what my mom said when I was six <laughs> and I said I was molested. She's like, No, doctor puts something in you, it's fine. <laughs> doctor gave me an injection. Uh, hot beef. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Speaking of, of movies, which There's I. There's a movie? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, didn't I do Did a you review? Did you see Super Bad? Yeah, I think I made a review of it. I want to see Super Bad. No, I don't think you reviewed Super I want to see Did Balls you? of Fury. I, don't I thought it would be really stupid, but Balls of Fury, you guys, is by the same people that it's do Reno 911. You saw Balls of Fury? It's pretty good. Yeah, Tom, I want to see it. Tom Lennon is awesome. Is, is, I love him. Is, I love him. Is Paul Rudd in it? That's all I, I need to know. He's in every movie now. They, it's there's a law. No, he has not. to be in every movie. Eh, I'm oh, not sure not? I'm gonna see it. George Lopez is. You love Paul Rudd. I love Paul I love Rudd. Paul Did you Rudd. date Paul Rudd? I would. I asked you, Christian. Mm-hmm. Oh, Christian would date Paul. <laughs> Rudd. I date Paul Rudd. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I was we just... need a camera. You gotta see his face. <laughs> oh what? shit! Yeah, if we were webcasting. What's going on? God, we're like into the eleventh hour of the podcast now. <laughs> oh, it's true. <laughs> gotta keep it going. Is it morning yet? Is it morning yet? When you use a noun. You won't be let down. Something, something, something. Person, place, or thing. When did that horrible guitar thing come in? We are in? so brilliant. We are. So I love. I love those synth keyboards. Brilliant. I can't even stand it. Mm. Okay. All, all right. right, let's do so, it. Oh, this is my segment. Oh, wait, um, drama, drama, drama. Right, so you guys, no, not drama yet. This oh. is a person, place, a thing. You sure. guys, I have a big surprise for you guys. As you guys know, <laughs> I'm friends with a lot of famous and influential people. Yeah. Well, I have a friend like us? who runs. Yeah, I have, I have a, a friend. friend. Oh, my God. Tila Tequila just accepted my, my space request. Oh, We're that friends. That was like five years wow. ago. We're going to hang out. That was like five years ago she accepted mine. Yeah, I was kidding. Congratulations. Oh. I was actually not putting it out there. Oh, my God. Oh, I'm I can't believe that you actually, you're like, yeah, well, I got that five years ago. <laughs> okay. Oh, I- As you know, I'm friends with a lot of influential and famous people. I'm being one myself. Mm-hmm. But I have a friend who, who runs. Wait, where's the. I need production on this. Well, I'm hey, just going to oh, do the introduction. Just go. Hey. All right. You don't have to oh. scream at me, Garg Marvin. I do. Now, listen to me. He actually gave me a tape. Syphilis. Of I'm someone, sorry. he gave me syphilis, and then he gave me a tape. Tape worm. Of, <laughs> shut up. There's someone. You guys have to guess who it is. There's someone very, very famous. Who's a very, very famous recording star who still uses tapes. No, 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 <laughs> no. There's a tape from Pamela the seventies before they were famous of Jimmy their Hendrix. demo of their first band. Oh wow, really? So now you guys have to guess who it is. Peter's gonna play who it is. You guys have to guess. Oh, I already guess. guess mm-hmm. who Are we these, guessing uh, the star you know? Or David the- Hasselhoff. The star, the star. You have to. You have to guess the band. You'll never guess. It's one of those things where you'll never. What if it's guess. like? What so if it's the like point? the Aquabats? They have like twelve but people in the band. But it's a super huge famous person. Okay. Uh, so she's fat. Is it Mick Jagger? Yeah. What do you mean super huge? We well, yes, for Hannah real. Montana. <laughs> Hannah. Mo- who is Hannah Montana? Who is Hannah Montana? Hannah Montana is the most famous person in the world at Target. Miley though. Cyrus. Who is, Billy who is Ray- Hannah Montana? Billy Ray Cyrus is Billy Ray Cyrus's daughter. And what does she do though? She has a, t- a TV show on Disney where she sings. Oh no! And wonder. her character is Hannah Montana. Are you guys going to guess here? He's going. Who producer is Producer Peter's going to play the who, first. Who is- we have to listen to it first, and then you can guess. I'm not finished my sentence. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Go ahead. She plays Hannah Montana, who is a rock star on the show. That's it. Oh. God. <laughs> <laughs> I have a friend that she was super pumped and excited. She's 21, and she got a, a role on Hannah Montana, like a small speaking part. I would be so excited um, if I got a role on Instant Star. <laughs> what's Instant Star? It's, an, it's, Instant a, it's another Star? noggin show oh that you've never heard of. They're doing our – shut up, you guys. Ready, go. Guns N' Roses. It's, it's the 70s, you guys. Wait, this is got to be Guns N' Roses. The band is from the 70s. The band, the, the, star of this band. This was done in the 70s and now it's a person who's a really famous now. Yeah, it's a <laughs> Are you authorized to play this? No, I'm not. Are we going to get busted? sued? Busted. Oh my god. Oh god. One of our millions of listeners are going to call in and bust us. <laughs> Are there any oh, lyrics? Or they, yeah. It's a beautiful song. Yeah, it's a Animal, vegetable, mineral. No, yes. 
Why is it fading out? Why is it fading out? We have to say something before the next song starts. All right, do the next song then. Okay, here's here's the next song. Oh. What, do you know who this is? Well, wait till everybody knows who it is. Do you have a guess? Do you have a guess? It's David. It's David's band. I know that band. voice. It's David's anywhere. first band. From 1976, my band. That's fucking badass, dude. You guys need to fucking leave the room. I'm serious. I know. Who does that remind you? A lot of people have been in. Wait, <laughs> Roger. Wait, what did he say? Hello? Shut up. What does no, it mean? No, no. It makes me think of Jefferson Airplane or something like that. Something like that. No, like, no. Like, like, um. Wow. Yeah, 1976. I got this band together. No. Hang on, there's no, another, there's another it's song. Not. What was that guy? Hot rap. Here, here's another song. Violent Femmes. That's what it sounds like. Kind of Violent Femmes. This reminds me of the Violent Femmes. You, you were on top of it. <laughs> Literally. I'm just grooving to this. But uh, you know what, though? I'm actually. Wait, I think I'm immature more. 10 years. Yeah, there's one more song. I'm immature 10 years in reverse, so I'm actually 12 in this. Because, uh, you know, like, no. I act at least 10 years younger than I really am. Mm, of at course. Least. Yeah, yeah, the camera takes off 10 years. So I'm actually or ads, 12 years old in this in 1976. I like this riff. Uh, one, did you say one, two, fuck yeah? I didn't say that. Linda Carlisle was in the band. Really? Cindy Carlisle was in the band? Linda Carlisle. Who's Cindy Carlisle? I don't know. I thought it was just David? <laughs> Some girl he did in the bathroom at 7 I, I understand why you left Orange Monkey. Oh. Why did I leave Orange Monkey? Because yeah, this tops elsewhere. Orange Monkey. <laughs> tops it? How does it top Orange Monkey? It was I done 30 years ago. Years old. I'm just saying. Oh, yeah. Were you really 12? I'm just saying. I hate that. Well, I was 22, Frank but I'm Zappa. at least 10 years. Frank Zappa. I sound like Frank Zappa. Zappa. Oh, Frank Zappa? Thank no, you. I still think it sounds like Violent Femmes. I don't think so, but the, I the, the hear second song, Femmes. I heard, I heard Frank, Frank, Zappa, Frank Zappa, everybody two. calls him musical genius, two. but more than Frank Zappa, I think that Moon Unit Zappa is yeah, much, he's, he's much a great talented. singer, horrible father. Singer, horrible father. You know what? Great singer, horrible father. I have nothing bad to say about that. Really? You liked it? Because it was you. Yeah. Oh, if it was somebody else, you'd be <laughs> yeah. If it was someone else, I, I probably just wouldn't have never heard it. Yeah. <laughs> but I was 12 years old at the time in 1976. Wow, that's awesome. Yeah. Were you really Thank 12 you. when you did Well, I was 22, but I'm... Ten I already explained uh -huh. this now. Well, people pretend like you didn't hear this I'm before. I'm sorry, I wasn't I'm listening. 20, I was 22, but I act Should at I least 10 years younger than I really am. Wouldn't right. you agree? There you go. Uh -huh. Sure. Well, so I was 12 then. Easily. Gotcha. Okay. All right. You were 12 Well, now. we should bring it back. It should be... This is. So it's about time. It should be retro. celebrating myself. We'll do a yeah, reunion let's tour. Yeah, get it together. You guys learn those songs and we'll do it. We'll take it on tour. <laughs> One, two, three, fuck take yeah. Take it on tour. Mm -hmm. One, two, fuck yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was the best part. <laughs> Not too bad. <laughs> so Peter's going to put this at the end of the man. podcast so everybody can hear the songs in their entirety. All right. Wow. Awesome. Thank Thank you, anyway, so Peter. there it is. That's Peter. so cool. I can't believe you guys guessed so fast. Well, how did, did it take you a minute to guess? As soon as the yeah, lyrics. I, I had nothing. You know what? The music. So how did you, did you hear it and go, oh, that no, is David? Or you still didn't hear it? Do you know what I got on my <laughs> science report? <laughs> Fourth grade How did quiz. You guys guess I'm so not fast? with it. How did you two get so fast? The music, when the music was coming in, I wasn't sure. Yeah. The second, yeah, the literally the second, yeah. I heard the singing. Was it the second? I it knew it was just you. like me, really. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. In thirty years, I haven't thirty. It's how you sing. One years, I haven't mm -hmm. changed my voice. At it's all. that beautiful banshee like singing. Beautiful. Is that good or bad? It's good. All right. Thank you. I, I pictured you with wispy locks of blonde hair. I bleached my hair blonde for a little bit. I don't know if it was blonde at that moment. Was it wispy? It was orange for a long time. I was in this orange period where I thought that was really cool. I need I've to see pictures I'm of this. Bleach and dye my, my beard for, for Halloween. I need to see pictures nice. of you with bleach blonde hair. I don't know yet. I don't even no, know. No, no, I are. need to, David. All right, I'll try to find Thank it somewhere. You. We could, well, we're going to have Mark dye his, dye, dye his his beard blue. He'll be blue beard. Blue yeah, is why don't cool. You your, why don't you do be blue? You need to like I could. I can straighten it. Blue beard. It needs to be, be like like maybe come you get to a, a patch point or something. You like being a pirate. Can oh, you, yeah. can, you, can you get it to come R. to a point or something? 
Can you get it to come to a point? It, like the way it just like festoons out the bottom? Oh, yeah, no, that, that's retarded. Like that. uh, usually I keep it like banded. Yeah. yeah or yeah. like Ra- Rachel uh, put it in braids the other day. That was kind of funny looking. Maybe Rachel that's why it's festooning Does your girlfriend so ever pull on it when you're making love? <clears throat> Do you get oh. less? Does she ever pull on your hair and say, say my name? Say my name! Do you get It's like, uh, what's your name? <laughs> pull my get, hair, bitch. Pull my hair. Sorry. Do you get less grossed out when you clean out your shower now because you can pretend every hair that's in the bottom of the drain is beard hair and not pubic hair? You know, funny story. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh-huh. Uh-huh. My pubic hair is not very long. I keep is that it a funny trim. story? Or is it Are you trim it? it? The funny thing is, is that my beard, ha- beard hair looks like obnoxiously long pubic hair. It really so does. So what I love doing at work is I love, I love like, I'll pull on it every once in a while. Every <laughs> once in a while, one or two come out, <laughs> and I'll leave them on, like, stuff for, like, my, my friend Wayne, Wayne or, like, my boss, Joe to wow. see. And they go, Your boss oh, is God, Joe to what see? is this? And I'm like, oh, it's a pubic hair. What? And they Joe freak out. You gotta do it to Wayne. See. It's funny on Wayne because oh. he's British. I was doing it to Wayne all day. I was pulling it. See, look. Ew, ew, ew. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, wait, cover it in semen, Mark. <laughs> You're guaranteed vomiting. I would put your beard hair all over my food. Or if it was mine, I'd just put it on yeah. my food so mm, no one wait, stole I'm it. Throw yeah. I'm gonna throw it. Yeah. But wait. would people really look if they were gonna steal Drink your water, food? Daddy. Are they really down for looking? No, but then but they would have a water. wonderful, <laughs> wonderful situation of eating it and then pulling a pubic hair out of their mouth and just. Right. Get, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> God, I wish we had a camera to catch that. Yeah. Uh, and I wish we had a camera. How many people want to see Mark at home in his bathroom trimming his pubic hair? I've already seen it. It's not really that exciting. <laughs> yeah, I think. Oh, it depends. <laughs> of I've course d- oh, it's not. But oh. it's the absurdity of it. Just turn on TV like TMZ and here's a garbage. <laughs> actually, and yeah, I, no, I could see that. That would be. Yeah. Should be interesting. I think, I think if I were like I, flipping channels and it flipped to somebody trimming a pubic hair, I'd be I, like, oh. I think what I've decided I'm going to do next, <laughs> my next, my next uh, trimming, I'm going to trim a design like a palm tree. Oh, nice. Or something into yeah. it. I think oh, that would be kind of funny. Oh my god, you got to tell us about that. That'd be in good, your pubic hair, or like, or like, or like, or like. Go How 80s could or you something. Have you know what? Tree. I really wish. I wish that you had never told us that. Took an anonymous picture, posted it on the internet, and then showed it to us. Hey, look oh what God. some guy did. Isn't this ridiculous. <laughs> and I'm like, oh wow, I actually like that. I think I'll do that. Oh yeah, well I started it. Yeah. Yeah. That was me. Because like, I would look you. at it if I didn't know who it belonged to. Right. Yeah. Well, you're not, not going to see my junk. You're you just going to see. Funny. Yeah. Because it's yeah. You'd have to have a wide angle gym. lens to get his junk yeah. in there. What? It's just, just the drama. It's part of drama. Ooh. You're going to see the tree. Everybody, the now it's time for oh, drama. I'm sorry. The producer o'clock. Peter. Time for no, drama. Put, <laughs> oh, producer oh, Peter set aside <laughs> time just for yeah, drama. Just We're on Anybody got any here. drama they want to talk about? Drama. Come on, Christian. You got drama all I got, up in here. I got, I got one suggestion. I yeah, think well, that. Uh, Mary Go Round broke down. Uh oh. I think it was. Gonna go off. Gonna go off. Someone's gonna go off. i gonna go off. I did my mic stop, or is my mic still working? Yeah, no, it's uh, right. um, So wait, yeah, you so, have drama? No, you no, I, I had a suggestion. I thought or that, uh, so on the shaving the pubes thing, you should have just like a big arrow no, pointed down drama. at your okay. crotch. I thought, like arrow. Oh. Awesome. I thought about that. Oh. Wait, do you have any drama going that's on? Good. Any have, drama, have, drama, have, drama, have, drama you want to talk about, I Mark? Have, I have drama. You have, have drama? Watching. Crystal, go ahead. I do. Drama. You, go. you love drama. Okay. Well, my mom's my mom's dad died recently. Oh, that's so sad. I'm sorry. And Yeah, thanks. But but he he had a friend who he had doing some of his banking for him. Mm-hmm. Oh, so oh. in order to do that, he had him as a joint signatory on all the accounts. Oh, no. So oh. now the guy is like, oh, I get all the money because it's all what? mine. Because uh, when somebody, when there's two people on an account, uh-huh. one person dies, then the other person gets the account. Uh-oh. No. How much money are we talking no about? Way. <laughs> oh, that's fucked I, up. I, I don't think I should say how much money we're talking about. But it's a significant amount. Is it into six figures? <laughs> this she's is for the lady studio audience. She's writing it she's down. By writing it down, she's trusting you not to say, say anything. anything. No, 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 no. Yeah, I, I I'm won't. not showing David Drader. I know oh. that much. I'm not that she's stupid. She's just showing if it's into but six figures. She's writing down the six. figure to see how many. She just drew a picture of Snoopy. I think there's seven. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's definitely it's. It's into seven <laughs> figures. Oh, she had to count how many <laughs> figures. That's it's into seven <laughs> figures. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait, why didn't he That's have your mom up, help dude. him? I think it's is it six, six? No. Yeah. Seven. seven? Wait, why didn't he have your mom help him? Wait, what? No, it's seven. It's it's six, six. Give six. me how many commas. But still six. it's in six, <laughs> so it's not bad. Like he doesn't know. Right. Uh, I thought you meant how many Wait. Number, seven or six. No, no. No, this six, is what six I don't figures, understand. Why figures. didn't he have your mom help him out? 
with which is his oh, daughter because right? even more drama because they've they've sort of been not uh, uh close for the past few years oh, or actually sad. for possibly a long time my grandfather was kind of like a little bit crazy okay. so he um so wait is the guy really saying that this is my money now go to hell sort of right now the, the account's been frozen so he's uh-huh. he's kind of um he's, he's maybe maybe willing to to make it make a deal for something wow but, um, sad i would never but do did that. he earn that money did, did well he said he helped him out and that he earned it but here's the thing for one you don't earn all my of grandfather it. my grandfather <laughs> yeah. um forgave his mortgage and forgave his daughter's mortgage or he this guy's allegedly forgave the mortgages um it see my grandfather he didn't he, his english wasn't that great Where was so it was from? pretty easy czechoslovakia oh wow Czech so he spoke french so yes so he um <laughs> Canada. that's trauma so he um i hate wow. that guy what's his name what's his first name the guy that I don't think that's trying to steal the money. When in yeah, doubt, go with Gerald. Gerald, <laughs> I Gerald. hate Gerald. Samantha. So <laughs> Gerald and Samantha cause a lot of shit. Okay, <laughs> they, they are the bane of our existence. Awesome here. Yeah. But yeah. Anyway, it's 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 a, it's a, as far as I'm concerned, an obscene amount of money that no one person needs to have. Yeah. And wow. he he did stuff for my grandfather. I need it. But, Wouldn't you like but to again, have it? Sure. But but the thing is, is he 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 had the mortgages forgiven. Yeah. And my grandfather was the type of person who was like, "Oh, you went to the grocery store for me. Thanks. Here's a thousand dollars. Oh, you <laughs> oh took my out my God. garbage. Thanks. Here's a thousand dollars. He was kind of like that. So, I mean, not every day per se, but he would have compensated him is your mom an only child my mom is an only child oh, if she gets my. it will she spend on something foolish or will she give part of it to you she'll give part of it to me nice so that you, guy you is have, a jerk. You that have stock in hating. a motherfucker. Seriously, that guy's an I asshole. I mean, he, he d- ran a lot of errands for him. We didn't really see him much for the, over the past 10 years, my grandfather. Yeah. But but this guy did, and he said that he's oh, more than a son to him and all this stuff, and that he did all this stuff for him. But still. Oh, my God. I just realized still. something. What? When my grandfather died as well, mm-hmm. his wife at the time was a cosign on his account as well uh-huh. and she tried to pull the same shit oh, on wow. my mom and her sisters as well i think wow there's this big dispute and like my mom People like suck. my mom like stepped up and she's like basically like i'll fuck you up like <laughs> <laughs> uh-huh i will fuck you i know when she gets good. that look I, in her eye her and her sisters like people. united and they're all you're not even my real mom yeah. don't even pull this shit good. no I kidding fuck they you threw up. down okay. yeah of okay. course but it was just okay. like okay. What? Oh, wow, God. that is. Well, well, so what's gonna happen? Is it gonna go to litigation? Well, we hope not, and and I don't think that he wants it to. Um, cause of yeah. course not, because he'll probably be found in the wrong. Well, I mean, it's hard. He to doesn't have find the money. Out a lot of stuff. They yeah. might. I don't know. They, he doesn't have the money to litigate. I don't think. But also, he's done some shady dealings. So yeah. mm-hmm. my my brother thinks he doesn't want them to come to light. Okay. Things also, like you could you could bring back those mortgages if there's not in writing, and you could you could ask him for that money too. Yeah. What what, oh, what well, happens? See, see the mortgages what happens when that you're he had. Mm-hmm. The mortgages he had were alleged written so that when my grandfather passed away they would be absolved but the, the way that the one that they saw that my mom saw uh-huh. the way it was written was that um, he, it had a survivorship uh-huh. and it listed it listed this guy and my grandfather both as the the lenders uh-huh. and then the guy's daughter as the borrower uh-huh. and then mm-hmm. it had a survivorship so that whoever Whichever borrower passed away, the other person would get it. And the lawyer's like, I've never seen a survivorship for the, I mean, the, sorry, for the lender. He's, she's like, I've never seen a survivorship for a lender before. Uh-huh. That's kind of weird. Yeah. And you, so, so he said, and the guy said, yeah, well, that, we, we did that. We put me on it so that if something happened to my daughter. I would oh, no. pay for it. So I think what might have happened, actually, to be honest, is that the guy might have tricked my grandfather saying, yeah, oh, we're saying. putting me on oh. so that if my daughter passes away, then I have to pay you. Yeah, this guy did but some really... shit. This guy did wow. some yeah. shit. Okay. okay. Yeah. The answer is A, precipitation. I didn't, yeah. I mean, I'm, I don't understand all of it, but it sounds like he totally was a douchebag. And I can't believe, I'm yeah, still so naive sounds like he that was I wouldn't pay for this. Oh, yeah. He, yeah. he was, and, and he kept saying like, oh, nobody can pull anything over on your grandfather. Nobody can pull the wool over his eyes. Oh. The the other thing is, kind of oh do. my god, more drama. I'm sorry, producer drama, Peter. drama. But, producer Peter, but keep it running. Drama. My, my grandfather um, had had diabetes, and we knew that. Uh huh. But he he also had um he also had cancer. Oh wow, oh, how sad. And the guy didn't tell us that he had cancer. My brother uh-huh. kept asking. He's like, "Is there anything else that we should know about about his health?" Blah blah. So he was he was. So if we had known wow. he had cancer, we probably would have. Gone and, gone and looked and at it. Yeah. You know, done, done more yeah. for him. How we think he, diabetes, he know? you know, somebody could live for 
yeah. 10, 20 years. Look at Wilford easily Brimley when they're yeah. when they're 80. Oh, forever. They can live a full life. Right, diabetes. but I mean, yeah. I mean, he was he was eighty nine. You know, okay. but he could have lived another 10, 20 years yeah. with diabetes. Wait, how long did the guy know he had cancer? I don't know. Oh wow! You can fi- if you find yeah. out like that, you can put this guy up on charges. Like seriously, like mm. there's some serious. You can fuck this. Well, guy. Oh, laws oh, in oh, Canada oh. are a bit sketchy, but oh, uh-huh. I, I know they, they don't really have. Go run Canada, through the wilderness, actually. but. Do yeah. they have do they have a penal system in Canada? Yeah. <laughs> <I> just, uh, <laughs> uh, oh yeah, porn. And you say you have a uh, problem with men. Uh, all right, all right, Dieter, get the fuck out. Okay. Uh, well, that is horrible. Well, we have to talk about that. Uh, see what's happening next drama. podcast. But that is. Drama. How do you wait? Oh, wait, we're all laughing. Fuck, at everything, but that was her grandfather. How do you? Feel I apologize now, for that. Crystal? Sorry. Fine. I I just I I, I don't just like drama. So, in the drama aren't yeah. you? so I'm happy to have it not be drama. Wow. I'm happy to have everybody okay. happy. That's well, well, we're not exactly Wait, happy. Did anybody but slap each me other off or horribly. pull each other's hair or scratch each other or anything? Well, that's no, what David sees as drama. Did you and your mom get in a fight when you were up in Canada? No, oh, yeah. but I yelled at her on the phone today. Does that make oh, you feel nice. better? Nice. Would you yell at her? David, David loves sh- yelling at, at mothers. Oh we can we can talk after, David. <laughs> yeah. All right. All right. Oh, well, thank guys. you. Thank you so much for joining us, our our wonderful oh, guests. Yeah. Uh, don't forget to enjoy the like dessert. It's the end of a date. And Christian, don't worry. Don't worry. The tips on me. No need to go Dutch. Um, I'll walk you to your door. <laughs> I don't what know. Kiss. Kiss. Oh no. The end. Well, oh, well the end of my day? dates are normally like. Uh, 1995 for the first one. Like, so are we gonna have sex the now? Or? And the expiration date is 1009. <laughs> yeah, that's um, uh, name on the card. Uh, All right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much. Thank you, producer Peter. Thanks a lot.